okay, once we're into uh, the VPN client and we're logged in at home, or if we're in eReg and we're logged in within school, we can get up the um, SIMs and get to the assessment sheets as follows. So we stick, click start and sims.net and we need to log into sims as normal. Just wait for it to load up. Again, I'm actually doing this from home rather than in school. You can tell that from the address at the top there. So there's, a, there's two different ways we can get to the assessment sheet, so I'll show you both things. First of all, if we're on one of our classes within the um, front page, we can right click and then go to mark sheets. And there it's taking us to our, our mark sheets. Or alternatively, if we're on the front page, we can go to focus, assessment, my mark sheet entry and it looked like we could even let's try this one my mark sheet entry here which is kind of a shortcut that takes me straight there as well now these bits are class lists so these are all my class lists for these for these um, groups that I teach um, obviously I've got some challenger tracking there and I've got data sheets for these classes as well but if I scroll down I've got maths exam data, uh, PE data, PE data, but then this one here, maths tracking progress staff entry, double click, and that takes me to my uh, sheet where I can actually record my assessments for my, math, for my maths group. So let's say for example, Remy Ashworth Quinn, 6C, and then I can either go with the cursor to the next one down, and it shows up as red, so it's ready to go. Let's say Che is on a 5B, and then I can press the down arrow on my keyboard, and that turns it red and takes me to the next one. Let's say Jack's on a 5A, again down, and then I'd go all the way down the list, all the way down, all the way down, and then I'd click on save, and that would save everything for me. Be very careful though, because once you save it, you can't get it back, so make sure you get it right, and make sure you double check. Um, then if I go back to browse, that takes me back to my sheets if I want to enter. Template name, if I click on here and I go to uh, year space 9 maths and I click enter, then it just searches for me within that, that specified name. So I've got just those sheets that have got year 9 maths on them. So if you've got a lot of sheets on there and you want to find them quickly, that could be a good way to do it.